everyone and thank you for coming today. I would like to start by saying what a pleasure it is to welcome on this very happy day all relatives and friends of both families. The fact that we have all traveled such long distances to be here is a testament to the kind of people Dan and Alicia are demanding. <laughs> so where do I start with Dan? For starters, he's handsome, witty, intelligent, Wait a second, sorry Dan, I'm having a hard time reading your handwriting. Uh, maybe you can just tell me the rest later. Uh, all those amongst you who know Alicia well will know that she is a wonderful and caring person. She deserves a good husband. Thank God Dan married her before she found one. <laughs> Alicia, I want your parents to know today that they have not lost a daughter, but gained an unplanned son. <laughs> In all honesty, Dan, you have been my best friend since seventh grade. Through all the hours of Quake, Goldeneye, Mario Kart, and Bomberman, we forged a friendship that can never be broken. It's an honor to be standing up here as your best man. I have a poem I would like to read called The Secrets of a Good Marriage. Growing up, I've learned about love. I've been surrounded by it every day. I'm so glad you've both found it, and that's why we're here today. They say there's secrets to a good marriage, that there are rules to obey, but the most important rules of love are what you two do every day. It's the hey babes in the morning. It's how she makes his tea. It's the way he smiles at her, such a sweet thing to see. It's never being too old to hold hands or to watch movies on the couch. It's accepting all the flaws, even when the others are grouch. It's facing the world as one, and it's more than love at first sight. It's together being a family each and every day and night. It's the way he looks into her eyes. It's the way that she looks too. It's the way they stand before us. It's why they said, I do. And now I stand here today on this, very, on this important moment in life with two people very in love, now husband and wife. Growing up, I've learned about love, and seeing it today proves it true. You've both taught me so much, and I'd be lucky to be half as happy as you. I would like to congratulate Dan and Alicia on their decision to embark on a journey through the rest of their lives together. So what is marriage exactly? In my opinion, it's the union of two really good forgivers. It's knowing that no matter what things come your way, you two can go through it together. I know that by the strength of your love and the virtue of your patience, you will have a long and lasting marriage. I wish you both health, wealth, and happiness for all the years to come. To Dan and Alicia. Um, I would like to thank everyone who's made this wedding possible because it's been the most spectacular day ever. Um, I'm Amber, Alicia's much younger cousin. <laughs> and by much younger, I mean by five months. 
exactly to the date, both born on the 27th, and we've been so close ever since. Our childhood was filled with the most fun, from water parks to apple picking, sleepovers, ice cream outings, opening picnics, haunted houses, Mario Kart, and mostly playing with Barbie dolls. I truly do not know what I would do without Alicia in my life. Alicia has filled my heart with the most warm, beautiful memories. And now that we are older, not much has changed. She is truly my best friend. No matter how much time we spend away from each other, each and every time we get together, it's like we've never been apart. So of course, when Alicia told me she was moving to Colorado, I naturally was very scared that we would never see each other or talk, but through our text messages, her trips home, my memorable trip to Colorado, and our frequent Uja Buja Snapchats, we managed to stay updated in each other's lives. And Alicia and I know that no matter what, we would always be there for each other. And she was there for me, and I am forever grateful. She stood by my side on my own wedding day, and she brought Dan. He was her plus one, and I knew I liked Dan right away. I knew I liked him because I could truly see how much Alicia was herself when she was with him. She was dancing all crazy, being silly on the dance floor with her cousins, and she didn't care what he thought at all. I am overjoyed that Alicia found Dan Shout out to Paul. <laughs> and how wonderful is it that she found him next to her beloved mountains. I've never seen Alicia more beautiful on the inside and out since she's moved to Colorado. She is glowing with happiness, and that is because of you, Dan. I think it's safe to say that we all believe Dan and Alicia are a perfect match. From your love of nature, hiking, farmer's markets, healthy cooking, tubing, paddle boarding. You two are so adventurous, and I cannot wait to see what the future holds for you guys. Of course, I secretly hope it's a bunch of little hippie babies. <laughs> Alicia, tonight you look more beautiful than any of our most popular Barbie dolls. <laughs> but for the heck of it, for old time's sake. Aww. Alicia got me a Barbie doll on my wedding day. But I deserve more credit because it's very hard to find a bride Barbie with brown hair. Dan, welcome to the family. I hope you love ice cream. And I just want you to know that no matter, since you guys are married now, she is still going to be my egg tossing partner for every family picnic there is. I love you guys so much. Thank you for allowing me to be your matron of honor. Cheers to Mr. and Mrs. Betchek. Amber for making me ball my hands out right before thanking everyone for coming. <laughs> so yeah, we just wanted to thank you so much for coming tonight. Um, when we were trying to decide what state to have our wedding in, it was really difficult because we knew that you would all have to travel really far to come be here on our big day. And I just want to let you guys know how many states people traveled here from. So hopefully I don't miss any because there are a lot. We have people here from Oregon, California, Texas, Colorado, Woo. <laughs> New Mexico, uh, Minnesota, Michigan, <laughs> Illinois, <laughs> Pennsylvania, yeah. <laughs> Georgia. <laughs> Tennessee. 
<laughs> All right, I didn't even know that. <laughs> oh, jeez, Tennessee. That's amazing. I mean, we have people here from all corners of the country, and just to have all the people that we love be in our hometown, <laughs> it made me cry again. It's just so amazing. <laughs> so thank you from the bottom of our heart for being here. Um, yeah, I haven't really prepared anything, but um, yeah, just <laughs> thank you all so much for coming and sharing this with us. It's uh, like Alicia said, you know, having everyone come here, you know, this is, I mean, this venue is on my bike ride to work, you know, so very convenient for us, so thank you. Walk this path every day. <laughs> but no, yeah, it really does mean so much to us. Like, everyone being here, everyone supporting us, and yeah, we love you all. Thank you so much. Look at the two of you dancing that way, lost in the moment, each other's face. So much in love, you're alone in this place Like there's nobody else in the world I was enough for her not long ago I was her number one, she told me so And she still means the world to me, just so you know So be careful when you hold my
Dan's bride to join him on the dance floor. Thank you. 